you can install any android apps on your pc there are so many options out there today i'm gonna use genie machine to do so so i'm gonna show you every single steps that you need to do for installing genie machine and installing any android apps so to do that firstly you need to install virtualbox and for installing virtualbox you need to download that And you can see I'm using a 64 bit operating system, so I need to download 64 bit and uh, for Linux and just select the AMD 64 bit and that's it. Now you need to download Genie Motion and uh, so open this website. I'll leave a link in the description below so you can download Genie Motion so from here to download that you need to create an account or if you have any account you need to sign in so i'm gonna create a new account and just uh, hit create button and after that you need to sign in and uh, after signing in you'll see a download option and just uh, select that download option and from here select get genie motion personal version and after that just uh, select a download genie motion personal edition and from here just a download download for ubuntu 64 bit and so that's it after downloading you will you need to install virtualbox so just open it with uh, software center Ubuntu software and just hit install so after installing you will see that virtual box so just close software Ubuntu software and after closing that you need to open terminal and then you need to type sudo su for entering root mode and use enter your password so i am in root mode now i need to go to download directory to to do so you i need to type cd downloads forward slash and you will see that so from here just copy genie motion 2.8 or whatever you downloaded and now type bash bash then space then that line so you can see that and now hit enter and then enter y then enter so that's it now you need to type ls and if you type ls you will see that uh, all file here and just uh, copy the directory opt genie motion and type cd then space then paste it here paste it the direction uh, you can see all file by typing ls and uh, you can see lots of file here and now you need to type dot for slash genie motion makes sure the sp spelling is okay and then hit enter so you will see that now you need to hit accept and in new uh, you need to hit yes and uh, here you will you need to sign in to your uh, genie motion account that you created just now or you, if you have any account just uh, log sign into your account so that's it i'm gonna make a google nexus mobile so that's like that then next then next so after that you will find your virtual device and then select that and open it so one more thing you should know that if you uh, create a tab then uh, it will be, work slow if you have uh, uh, a pc with a low configuration so i'll recommend you if you have to make a small size a uh, small resolution uh, device if you have low configuration pc so here is my android phone and now i can uh, install any app from here to install any app i need to open uh, internet browser 
and from there i can uh, search any app for example if i want to download whatsapp then search download whatsapp hpk after downloading just uh, hit that and uh, now i need to enable from enable installing from unknown source and if you select that uh, unknown source then you can install select the application that you downloaded then select next next so you can see there is class plans so i can use mobile application android application Now I'm gonna download WhatsApp. And if you wanna download the, uh, if I wanna download WhatsApp from here, I can select that. Using this, using this device, virtual device, I can uh, install any Android application, cause it's uh, it's a virtual Android phone in my Ubuntu. So that's it for today if you got any question or any problem you can leave a comment below and if you want any tech videos from me you can also leave that in comment below i'll try to answer you and thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one